Hi everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Thursday, 3rd of November 2022. This trade was shared by Yasin, who's trading S&P 500. And as you see here, the macro chart shows that the support level was rejected. And you can see it as a channel in the trading chart better, which is the three minute chart and you see the uptrend channel clearly and he found the entry in the smaller tick charts here which is the trading chart and with the entry here properly based on algo one to five and exit strategy number one with the stop loss and targets that is assigned properly and reach the target and yasin is going to share the trade video with you thank you yasin for sharing your trades with us the next trade was shared by mh who's trading dax CFD and as you see his structural chart is showing clearly a downtrend and as you see the momentum increased clearly at this point and is trying to retest the previous support area so he entered this trading channel with the entry here and exit properly at this point so thank you MH for sharing your trades with us the next trade was shared by Easy who's trading S&P 500 CFD using Forex Broker. As you see, the macro chart shows clearly a downtrend. This is four hours chart. And then you can see the breakout happen. And this is the channel that you can see it in the structural 30 minute chart clearly as a downtrend. And so he waited for the pullback to be completed and entered with the one minute trading chart uh using this channel at this point he entered and trail it and exit on the other side of the channel using exit strategy number one so thank you easy for sharing your trades with us the next few trades were shared by yan or global instructor trading micro nasdaq futures as you see the time that he traded the macro shows sideways and the trading chart shows that the breakout happened we see a downtrend channel is forming and you can see it better with the trading chart so he's taking all pullbacks repeatedly and short it and manage the trades using ninja trader atm and you see here example of entries and exits uh, that he is repeatedly taking whenever he sees the sellers are coming back and the pullback completes he enters the trades and the result is here shown. From the 14 trades, he had a profit factor of 99, which is infinite because there was no losing trades. 100% was winning, and the average win was about $6. So thank you, Yan, for sharing your trades with us. These are some of my trades. I waited for the market to calm down after 10 o'clock on its MPMI news. So the volatility as you see is very high and is not tradable. At this point the volatility was less. So I tried some short position here after rejection of the resistance level. And it was choppy again. Uh, market was not in very good downtrend. Again this level was retested and got rejected. So I tried the short position after this rejection here and ATM is still prematurely came out so I came back at the end of market and there was a good solid a smooth downtrend so I repeatedly took short positions and added to the position and managed them and as you see this works better because volatility is not so high now and you see the live trades in higher speeds. So I was getting close to the previous support level at this point. So it's usually choppy and volatile. So I stopped trading. And that's the end of my trades for the day. So thank you very much for your attention and hope you have a great day.